All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back for another game of Beat Rhea and Fran. This is game 51 officially. The last game 51 has an asterisk above it because Noah got some of the scoring wrong. Reputation came out in 2000. 17, not 2018, yeah. as our lovely listeners let us all know this past week that the scoring was wrong. So we yep. have we a thought we won, rematch. We, didn't. we did not win. We have a rematch with Rosie and Kira, which we feel is the most justifiable way to go about this. Yeah. People said, how? How do we serve justice to them? And the only way is with a good old-fashioned rematch. So welcome back to the show, ladies. And I love this. I feel like we have banter now. I feel like we have history. It feels comfortable. We're exactly. Ready. We feel the same way. Now, Noah, is there anything you would like to say about your I'd massive mistake? Full responsibility. I, okay. you know, I'm not going to make any excuses, even though I can. Uh, yeah, it was my fault. I, we honestly should Noble. have had like Devin do it today or something. Like I took like we sh suspended. We should or have honestly. Um, now it's a little too late. Yeah, that's okay. But I think you just, you know, make sure you're Listen, make sure you're fact checking. The sad thing is, is that yeah, like if I just I, didn't fact check I, it, yeah, you have to fact which check. I've done in the past. Yeah, but this time it's like I tried to fact check and somehow still got it wrong. You should have mm -hmm. went to Spotify. That's the worst feeling is, and that's happened multiple <laughs> times now. Is when I check DMs and some girls like, you got the thing wrong. And I'm you like, did this and one. I go I, no, and then I look it up and I'm like. I will say this though. I just said you should go to Spotify. Don't go to Spotify because there's an album, Drake's album, uh, well, Nothing Was the Same, came out in fall, September. And I will always remember that that album came out in September. And on Spotify, it says it came out in January, which I know for a fact is not Are true. You sure. I am 100% sure. <laughs> That's so weird. I know for a fact that album did not come out. In January, I know what it album came was out of, it. Nothing was nothing the same. Nothing was the same. Wait, let me look it up on Wikipedia. That album came out in the fall. I know it, it says January and and Spotify. Oh yeah, it's se September no, September twenty fourth. Yep. Yeah, interesting. Hmm? Well, did you did you check in Spotify? I or did. No, no, did I you two thousand seventeen on Spotify for Taylor Swift. Oh oh oh. Yeah. So, so I mean, if it was early. I, it's not no, going to say when I googled it too. It everything said twenty seventeen. Oh, yeah. So I, I don't know how you saw twenty eighteen. I do. Maybe I googled a, a different album. No, did no she, she put didn't out an have album an album come out in twenty eighteen. No. Yeah, I don't know. That's okay, guys. His lover was twenty nineteen. Yeah, we're gonna have a rematch, and hopefully there'll be no Taylor Swift album questions on this one. There aren't. This is so just like another thing with me and Taylor Swift, you know. Right, yeah. We should have given you but a one I, I do love Taylor, so I'm kind of disappointed that it happened. I know, I know. I, as do I. I was like, damn, that should have just been something it gotten right anyway. But I love because a rematch. Then I, when you think about it, it makes sense. She was doing every two years, but then with the, the there was all the drama. She delayed, and then she put out Reputation. It so it would have been 2016, but then it was 2017. 2017, and I was like, you're wrong. And then we found out later. And it's like, oh, no, you actually won. Yeah, Ooh. yeah, that's just not what happened though. So yeah. we can't li live. We can't live in the what ifs. No, we we gotta live in the present. Let's get on with the game. I'm excited. <laughs> Me too. Uh, I don't. I don't even have to go through the rules again. I don't think because know this. you guys have We're done this. We're back. We're doing it. 15 rounds with the most points at the end wins. We'll alternate. Noah's gonna give us another new movie here to guess the Rotten Tomato score. You guys give out your guesses. We will uh, alternate guesses. And Noah, what is today's movie? Today's movie is Paul Blart Mall Club. Oh, my one movie I refuse to watch. The first one. I saw that movie in theaters. So did I, I think. You guys know that's my one movie I refuse to watch. Wait, why? I've talked about this. Just because it's one of those movies that I've gone so long without seeing that I now refuse to ever watch it. And it's not one that I don't think anybody would say you have to watch. <laughs> I know, I don't so know why. <laughs> no. All right, you, one of you go yep. first. Um, Rosie, you go first this time. I have absolutely no clue. Okay. Uh, twenty-three. That's a good guess. I'm gonna go. With, can I go? Yep. I want. I'm going like five. Okay. Five percent. All right. I was gonna go around. Well, there. don't. But no, I won't. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm gonna take the teens, like um, fourteen. Okay, so she went twenty-three. She went fourteen. You went nine. There's no way it's higher. Like, Where there's just the no way. do I go? Do I go between 9 and 14, or do I go between 14 and 23? I'm going to go... Come on. What does your gut tell you? 
12. My God, my God is telling me 12. Okay, go with 12. 12. It's 34. 34? Whoa. What? So 23 is the closest, right? Yeah. That is shocking. That is so much higher than I thought it would be. a terrible movie. That, Maybe I'm thinking of the second probably. one. That movie got what's so much the, higher than... What's the Rotten Tomato score on Paul Blart Mall Cop 2? <laughs> Paul Bart Mall Cop <laughs> 2 is 6%. Yeah, that's what okay. I'm thinking of. All right, yeah, that's that what I was sense. thinking of. Okay. All right. Seems like we're starting off in the same way we did last time. <laughs> okay, question number one. Shout out Amanda from DC. This is to Kira and Rosie. What was Kim Kardashian originally going to name Skims before receiving public backlash? Rosie, do you know this? Yeah, Kim Mono. Go for it. Kim Mono. Final answer? Yes. Correct. Nice. <sighs> <laughs> All right. One nothing, Kieran Rosie. They're going to make it hard for us. <laughs> Question number two. Shout out McKenna from Buffalo. In Gossip Girl, what is the theme of Chuck and Blair's Halloween party? I have no idea. No idea. Really don't have any. Chuck and Blair's Halloween party? Is it the mask? Sometimes I wish one? they'd give us like a Did season. Chuck and Blair or have like a Halloween a party? Timeline. A masquerade? Ma like Masquerade. Well, they did have a mask, but that wasn't know, Chuck and Blair's party. But that party. wasn't Chuck and Blair's Halloween party. 10 seconds. Was it like something something in hose? <laughs> yeah, probably. I've, I don't, I've don't got know. nothing. Don't not know. even a guess. And we're not even going to give a guess because we don't want to hint anything. I, I don't even have a guess. All right, to I don't Rosie. even have one to give. <laughs> Rosie, I feel like you're smiling a little bit. You have, definitely know this. I think it's Saints and Sinners. They definitely throw a Saints and Sinners party. So I think it's that. I, I, that's the only thing that's coming into my head right now. Yeah, I, I thought the mass grade thing too, but I don't know. So Saint, let's go Saints and Sinners. Okay. Okay. Saints and Sinners, final answer. Incorrect. Mm. It's 1920s. This is the theme. Oh, oh, sure. Okay. Could have could have maybe used a little more s clarification on that well, one. You want me to that's give okay. you the answer? No, no, continue, no, no. Continue on, please. Maybe like a season. I think, I think the question it wouldn't have mattered anyway. I don't. I'm. I don't know any Gossip Girl trivia. Okay. Shout out Alyssa from. I don't even know what this is. It says K C M O. Kansas, Kansas City, City Missouri. Missouri. Oh, interesting. <laughs> <laughs> so weird. Okay, question number three to Karen Rosie. What two actresses had their first kiss with Dylan and Cole Sprouse on The Sweet Life of Zack and Cody? Also name which twin they kissed. Oh, God. Um, who could they have kissed? Like, um, okay, so stars. Selena, Selena Gomez? Gomez? Yeah. Um, okay, uh, anyone else? Demi Lovato, no. No, not Demi. Um, 10 seconds. Okay. Let's go Selena Gomez kissed Dylan. Cole Sprouse, Dylan Sprouse, and Demi Lovato oh, kissed Cole, which is totally wrong. Yeah. Incorrect. Yeah. Incorrect. Allison Stoner kissed Cole Sprouse, and Selena Gomez kissed Dylan Sprouse. You said that with a lot of confidence. I don't, I'm not uh, very confident, oh. but what do you think? I don't need, I'm confused, but can you read the question again? What two actresses had their first kiss with- Both of them <clears throat> had their first both kiss. Both of them kiss. had their first kiss. The okay. girls. Okay. With Dylan and Cole Sprouse. I'm gonna, different. I'm gonna lock in my answer. Allison yeah. Stoner, Cole Sprouse, Selena Gomez, Dylan Sprouse. Yeah. Incorrect. <sighs> Selena Gomez did kiss Dylan, but Victoria oh. Justice kissed Cole. Oh, I remember that. Ah, oh, shit with the pageant. Damn it. I wasn't remembering Oh, that. man. All right. Question number four to Rhea and Fran. Still won nothing, Kieran Rosie. Uh, and this is a uh, shout out Monica from Vancouver. Name the three songs from Drake's album, Take Care, that Lil Wayne featured on. Don't look at me. This side have no idea. Hell yeah, fucking right. H, H Y F R. <laughs> uh, 15 seconds. The motto. And. Uh, oh, man. Five. 
time is up. I don't know the third one. All right, Karen Rosie. Rosie, this is all you. Not. I no. have no idea. Can you repeat the question? <laughs> no, Noah, will you repeat the question? Name the three songs from Drake's album Take Care That Little Wayne featured on. Uh, you're writing up a storm over there. What are you writing down? I'm writing down the questions. I'm trying to. <laughs> Five seconds. I, I don't I don't know. I don't know. I have no idea. Okay. The correct answer, you had two. The motto, H Y F R. The real her. Mm, I would have never gotten it. Damn. All right. Question number five. Still one nothing. <clears throat> Kieran Rosie. Shadow from Shadow McKenna from Buffalo again. Which Sanderson sister died first in Hocus Pocus? Kira, that's all um, you. I've never seen it. I know, but and I just saw it too. Um. I just, Sarah Jessica Parker. I feel like I feel like it's Sarah Jessica Parker's character, but I can't remember what her name is. Um, I want to say Sarah, but that can't be it. No, I don't know. Don't know. Nothing. Nope. All right, Terry and Fran. I cannot remember any of their actual names. I've never seen Hocus Pocus. That is a sin. I've never heard either. Oh. <laughs> it is yeah, what are you guys doing? I have Hocus seen Pocus either. is fantastic. I'm gonna go with uh, Mary. Final answer? Yeah. And correct. Winnie. Damn. Winnie. That's my grandmother's name. I'm the worst person. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, still one nothing. This is question number six to Rianne Fran. Shout is out. one of them named Mary? Uh, Just ease my mind sister. for a second. It seemed right to me. Um, Bet. No, that's her oh. real name is Bet Midler. <laughs> yes, Mary. Mary. Mary is one of them, right? Yes. Okay. Thank Mary, you. Mary, Sarah, Winifred. Oh, there was a Sarah. Oh, Sarah Jessica Parker does play Sarah. Uh, I think so. Yeah, she yeah. does. Okay. Oh, Kira, you were sort of right. Yeah. Okay. I was wrong there. Winifred. Question number six, and this is to uh, us. Yeah, us. you guys. Shout out Brooke from Rhode Island. Name this year. Grey's Anatomy premieres. Kelly Clarkson, Since You've Been Gone, hits number one on Billboard. Brad Pitt and Jennifer Aniston get divorced. That was the first 2002? 2003 was the first year that popped in my head But it's probably wrong But we can go with that 2003, 2003. To that, We're gonna go 2003 I'm so tired of getting things wrong I can't take it okay. <laughs> Rosie, I thought 06 I think 04 Okay, so Grey's Anatomy I believe it's in the 18th season so okay. I think it's 2004. Okay, you did that math already? No, not really. <laughs> <laughs> no, that makes that as up. As the math teacher, okay. it adds up. Um, right, 04? 04. Wait, but that's the last year of Friends. Which is, does that make sense? Okay, fine. 2004. Incorrect. It's 2005. Oh, damn, it's 2005. 2005. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let me tell it. you, my 2005 was, was never coming out of my mouth. All right, still one nothing. Wow, low scoring game. Question Again. number seven to Kira and Rosie. Shout out Jenna from Charlottesville, Virginia. In a viral Vanity Fair interview, Kiki Palmer famously says, "I hope I don't sound ridiculous. I don't know who this man is. I mean, he could be walking down the street. I wouldn't know a thing. Sorry to this man. Who is this man? Who is this man?" Oh my gosh, it, um, Kira, I don't know why, but I think it's, um, uh, oh my God, the, pre not the, he went for president, but he didn't make it, um, with the B, um, Bernie, Bernie Sanders. Sanders. I'm pr I don't okay. know why, I'm pretty sure it's Bernie Sanders. All right, let's go with Bernie Sanders. Okay. <laughs> Final, Final answer. answer. Damn. It made sense to me. 
I don't remember <laughs> this at all. Uh, this is so bad because we should know this. You know the clip, right? No. Yes. Yes. You don't know the clip. Yes. It's like a meme. You, you do. Is it Zach you, you and do. No, it's like... Um, <laughs> oh, God. I don't think Kiki Palmer knows who Zac Efron is. I don't know. Wasn't she like on Disney with him? She was on she Nickelodeon. Was on Nickelodeon. Yeah. All right, five seconds. I don't. I don't know. Nothing. No. You guys were on the right track, Kira and Rosie, because it's Dick Cheney. Oh. oh. I was trying to. I was thinking. I, po- I knew. I was politics. Oriented, but I would have. Yeah, I mean that. Never, that's why it seemed right ever, to me. ever, ever, <laughs> yeah. ever guessed Dick yeah. Cheney. Never would I have ever guessed Dick Cheney. Well, I don't think I know what Dick Cheney looks like. <laughs> <laughs> okay, question number eight. Still one nothing. Kieran and Rosie. This. Is... I also don't think I know Dick Cheney walking down the street. You wouldn't know, if you saw oh, pictures. I think he's you wouldn't dead. know. Is he not? Maybe no, if you showed me pictures, dead. I'd no, be like, he's oh, alive still. But... Did you ever see that movie where Christian Bale played him? Vice. No. Great movie. If you show me pictures, maybe. But, you know, off the top of my head, I can't picture him. <laughs> All right. Question number eight. You are the meme. Yeah. You are you're, Kiki, you're Palmer. Kiki Palmer. Sorry to, sorry to that man. <laughs> Was everybody, like, so mad at her? No. It's just so oh. funny the way she said it. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay. Oh, fuck. He was the vice president. <laughs> yes. Yes. He <laughs> shot someone. You don't, you don't remember that? Yep. <sighs> no, it sounded He's familiar. definitely alive. It sounded because familiar. Because I really thought he died. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm, I'm just... Bad at U.S. history. <laughs> All right. Yeah, he was a vice president like while you were alive. Yes, I know. <laughs> I, I'm now picking up on that. I was very young. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Question number eight to Rian Fran. Shout out Anna from Wisconsin. <laughs> Name actress Maya Hawke's parents. Um, Ethan Hawke and Uma Thurman. Final answer. Correct. Way to go. Thank God, got one right. Good job. I didn't know Uma Thurman was... Her mom? Her Uma mom. Thurman. And I also didn't know that Ethan Hawke... Were they married, Uma Thurman and I, him? I think so. Uma? I don't know if they were... Like, I used to I'm love pretty sure, Uma yeah. Thurman, Kill Bill. They were together for... She's cool. I was they were together for a pretty long time, I think. Yeah. Uma Thurman's cool. Also, yeah. oh no, I had the biggest crush on Uma Thurman in uh, the Batman where she played... Uh, who did she play? Poison Ivy. Mm. <laughs> I was like, oh my. okay. <laughs> whoa, whoa, okay. <laughs> no, like as a kid, I would just yeah. watch that movie on a repeat. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> All right. Um, okay, tied up at one. This is question number nine to Kieran and Rosie. Shout out Shauna from New Jersey. In the Counting Crows hit song, Accidentally in Love, what flavor ice cream is mentioned? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm seeing it in my head. Um, when is the ice cream? I mean, well, I feel like, is it mint chocolate chip? I don't know. I'm totally guessing. Um, I can't think of any ice cream. Any part that has Shaw- ice cream in it. You know the song though, right? Yeah. Strawberry? Want to go with strawberry? Kinda. Yeah. Okay. Let's go strawberry ice cream. Okay. Final answer. Final answer. Correct. Whoa. Yes. Wow. Yeah, <laughs> that was a they shot say, uh, well, baby, I surrender to the strawberry ice cream. Strawberry never, ice ever end uh, all really... this love. Yep. Mm-hmm. Wow. That was good Luke guess. only. Mm-hmm. All right. Oh, Is that gum? Guess. No. Oh. <laughs> Two, one. Kieran Rosie. And now this is question number 10. I'm going to play a movie clip. And you tell me what movie it's from to Rian and Fran. Wait a second. I was just thinking about it. That's all. A tip, Ben. When your girlfriend says, let's go to Paris for the weekend, you go. All right, all right, I'll go, I'll go. You'll go? You know what, actually, I have a better idea. I think I'll take him. Fever pitch. Final answer. Final answer. Correct. <laughs> oh, Great man. movie. This is not great my movie. game. Honestly, like, I know everyone in Boston hates that movie, I, I, but I it's think a it's good a movie. great Why movie. Why do they hate that movie? Because I it's just, it's like, great corny movie. and, like... It is corny, it's but it's not a good like, movie. It's a great movie. No, I, lo- I love it. Fever Pitch is an awesome movie. And, like, yeah. it's easy to hate Jimmy Fallon now, but, like... Good yeah. movie. Good movie. I love it. Drew Barrymore. Yep. Okay. Here, did you know it? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was Isla Fisher. I can't really hear it that well. Is I don't know if that, like... That it That's sounded really like her, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. T- tied up at two two all, one might say. Um, 
All right, question number 11 to Kieran Rosie. Shout out Carolina from Brooklyn, New York. When Brad Pitt guest starred on an episode of Friends, what holiday were they celebrating? Thanksgiving. percent <laughs> Final answer? Yeah. Correct. The I Hate Rachel yeah. Green Club. Yeah. That's a great. That's the yeah. only scene I've ever laughed at. It's a really good episode. It's a great episode. Okay. 3 2, Kieran Rosie. This is question number 12 to Rian Fran. Shout out Hannah and Lauren from Buffalo. In the movie Hocus Pocus. Oh, two what? Here we go. Two Hocus Pocus. It's questions? Halloween season. Uh, why? Why Noah, would you pick Noah. two Hocus Pocus? Why would Hocus you pick questions? Halloween and you know season. I've never seen Hocus Pocus. I don't know. I didn't. Know we talked about it. this. Well, I'm not picking this based. No, on I know you're not picking would, based no, on no, me. No, but, but I would just like to say I thought no, no, we made a rule that we were not going to do. But it is October. Okay. No. Okay. Maybe another Halloween movie, but not two Hocus Pocus questions. Correct. I'm already out. I'm not answering the question. All right. What's the question? In the movie Hocus Pocus, what is the name of the black cat? <laughs> Why can I only think of the name of the zombie? Is it a day of the week? No. Five seconds. I can't remember. Time's up. Rosie, you don't know. Heck no. I want to say thanks. Okay. This, I feel, but or or Zachary Banks is either his full name of the main kid or it's the cat. So I'm going to say thanks for the cat. Final answer. Final answer. Yeah. Say it again. Thanks. No, she's wrong. She's don't, don't, don't you give that to her. I'm not gonna give it to her. Because oh, she said it, and now I know what it is. Binks. No, it's Thackeray Binks. You Thackeray. Didn't get the full name. Oh, Thackeray yeah. Binks. Thackeray. Yeah. But it's pin- Binks, not Banks. No, no, yeah, it's Binks. Yeah, yeah. You know what? B-I-N-X. I thought that because I was like, is that their accent? Because I knew yeah. it wasn't. I would say Banks. I also I think saying. I would. I also think I would have said Zachary as well. Yeah, Thackeray. Yeah, I forgot it's Thackeray. Okay. Still three two. Underrated, Kieran Rosie. terrible Thackeray. And this question <laughs> is to Kieran Rosie. Shout out Nicole from Boston. Name three musical acts that have been openers for Taylor Swift's tours. Oh, we okay. went to one. Mara. Um, Camila right. Cabello. Camila Cabello, Ed Sheeran. Yep. And, and a Charlie X the X. Yeah. I thought so. I think she. They both opened for her when we went to see her at uh, MetLife. I wasn't at that concert. You're thinking that I was, but I wasn't. Charlie XCX, Ed Sheeran, oh, and Camila Cabello. Could it be? Could it be Cody Simpson? Was he also project. opening for her? I don't know. Just do which one. You, Char- Charlie XCX, right, Charlie XCX, Ed Sheeran, and Camila Cabello. Correct. Mm. Yeah. Yes. yes. I have. Wait, here. Like Cody Redemption. Simpson there? I mean, there's a lot of people. Shawn Mendes is one. Yeah, Shawn Mendes. Uh, uh, Austin Mahone, Haim, Vance Joy. Yeah. All right. Oh, wow. Four two. Was Cody Simpson not right though? I don't have that on here. Um, Thank God. Thank God. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Four two. Kieran Rosie. This is question number fourteen to Rian Fran. Shout out Lizzie and Ren from College Station. They're back. Uh, what year does Harry Styles mention in the song Grape Juice? I have no idea. Sing it. I have no I can't idea. E- I couldn't even sing the song. Really? I did not listen to this album <laughs> yeah. over and over again. I listened to it once or twice. I did not enjoy this album. So no, I, mean, I, I do can not s- know. I can sing this the I can sing the album. I can sing the chorus, but like I know that it's not in the chorus, so that's pointless. Um five seconds. <laughs> Two thousand. Incorrect. <laughs> to Kieran Rosie. Oh, I don't know, know what it is. is. I don't know it either. Um, just lost, by the way. Let's go 2012. 2012 rolls off the tongue. Uh, incorrect. 1982. 
Yeah. Oh, he wasn't even was he he wasn't even born yet. <laughs> no, of course not. <laughs> All right. Uh well, you guys did win, but we'll yeah. do the final question. Wow. Well done, ladies. Honestly, probably deserve to win Justice the first one served. in the first place. So, Well, wow. you don't know. I think of yeah. you to say for us. Yeah. <laughs> Justice has been served for Kira and Rosie. Question number 15 to Kira and Rosie. Shout out Julia from South Jersey. In New Girl, what's the name of the series Nick Miller writes? The um, zombie something you don't know this rosie i've never seen it oh my god this is i mean i know we won but it's still gonna piss me off if i don't get this something zombie oh z is for zombie maybe is that it that's my final answer incorrect the perk or what is it i, oh, I, I don't remember ask. you don't know no the pepperwood chronicles the pepperwood mm, pepperwood chronicles, chronicles. yes Pepperwood. All right, low scoring game, four two. Mm -hmm. That not our game today. Not, not our game. Not it. No. Nope. <laughs> Morale is low in this studio. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think Rhea's really stuck on the two hocus pocus questions, which I back her up on. That's 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 fair. <laughs> I'm happy that you guys won. Yeah, though. very well deserved. You, you guys are great you guys at pop culture yeah. trivia. Yes, and you we guys definitely. Are. We played terribly. Maybe we will have a, was, a championship. Yeah, one day. We would love that. Now, now we have to send you a shirt on top of yes. what we already sent you. Uh, yeah, <laughs> now you get the. And now you actually now do got, get the beat. B Rian franchise. Right. <laughs> Amazing. You well, guys were amazing. Guys, thank you so much. And thank you for thank coming back to play again. I know yeah, like it's in the middle of the day and schedule. So thank you so yes, much. Thank you. And um, thanks for having yeah. us. Yeah, and of course. Noah. We'll talk. <laughs> oh my I'm god, kidding, guys! I'm kidding. I'm They're kidding. so mean to me. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm joking. They're so mean to me. I'm scared. That was such a well I don't, don't want to. I don't want this to end because when the cameras go off, I'm scared. Oh, stop! <laughs> stop. People are Good gonna luck, think. Noah. People are gonna think you're serious. Am I? If I don't they, know. If oh they god. think he's serious, like honestly, just get a new brain because I can't <laughs> deal with it anymore. This is, oh my god. All right. Yeah. Don't Bye. leave. Kieran Rosie, don't leave. <laughs> Bye, guys. Thank you. Thank you, guys, again. Bye, Bye. guys.